My garden has a lot of grapevine. And I've sleeved something special on it. I'm going to remove the sleeve now. So I have to put away my camera for one second, I think. Because it will be hard to remove it with one hand, I think. Or maybe not, let's try. Hmm, let's open this up. Oh wait, it's working. I don't have to put away my camera. Here we have nice grapes. Of course, I'm not going to eat them. They are food for a nobler creature than me. Let's see, where are you? Where are you? Hmm... It's hidden in here somewhere. It should be... Either that or it's hidden in the sleeve. That could be as well. Ah! There it is. Hmm... It's not looking very healthy, actually. Oh wait! It's spinning a cocoon! I'm sorry, this video is going to seem very schizophrenic to all of you. One second, please. Oh, it has it is spinning a cocoon. That's why I couldn't find it. There you are. That's actually very nice. What you're looking at now is a Leupa species that's endemic to uh, to uh, Taiwan, the Lopa formosensis. Yes, I know you write Lopa, but you pronounce it Lopa. Well, it's um, that's interesting. I didn't know it was spinning a cocoon. I was about to show you the larva, but uh, this is even better. Here we have some eaten leaves, half eaten leaves. I really love Lopa, they are very pretty moths. I hope I can obtain more species of them soon. I've bred Oberturi many times, but I have still have to breed other species like this. I still want to breed Megacore as well. And I can name a few others that are still on my to-do list. Hmm. Thanks for watching anyways.